Hey. Hey. Come on, wake up. Hey, hi. <laughs> shh, shh. We don't want anyone to wake up. Come down. Come on, come down. Yeah. Okay, be careful, be careful. I'll, I'll, I'll go down the regular way. I'll see you in a, I'll see you in a second. <laughs> hey. Oh, <laughs> How are you? What can I say? I missed you. I wanted to be around you, obviously. And I know... And I know that you're staying at your folks' place for a few weeks, so I figured maybe sneaking over at night might be fun. <laughs> oh, come on. You got to admit, the whole, like, stone thing on the window was pretty cute. It's a cliche for a reason. <laughs> oh, come on. Give me a smile, baby. Please. I just want to see my sweet, sweet girlfriend smile. Oh, <laughs> there she is. I missed you. I missed you so much. I mean, come on. I have a right to miss my girlfriend after not being able to see her for, what, weeks? Okay, sure, it was days, but it felt like weeks. I know you haven't told your parents yet about us or... You, but come on, I still want to see you. Just because you're staying with them for a few weeks doesn't mean that you get to avoid me like the plague. I'm not gonna let you. <laughs> you're glad I'm not glad. <laughs> Stop. You, can, you won't even. <laughs> you have to at least let me finish saying what I'm saying, please. <laughs> Too many kisses, too many... <laughs> okay, okay, stop, stop. Let me finish my thought. Come on, I'm trying to be sweet. Thank you. What I was going to say before I was so rudely interrupted was that just because you're staying with your parents for a few weeks doesn't mean that you get to avoid me. Not that I'd let you avoid me, because I love you too much. <laughs> Choke on that, bitch. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please come back. I let the thoughts win. I'm sorry. Come back. Come back to me, my love. Come here. <laughs> you know, you could have stayed with me if you needed. I mean... Yeah, that would have been one way for your parents to find out. Imagine your dad. So, where are you staying at while you're looking for a new place? Oh, I'm gonna be staying with my girlfriend. Girlfriend? And then he just... <laughs> right there, on the spot. I know it's not the best light to put him in, but at least he didn't do anything drastic. He just sort of had a heart attack. There are worse things that could happen than a heart attack. <laughs> I am not saying I want your dad to have a heart attack. That is the last thing I want to say. I've known that man for years at this point. Please. I am your best friend. And also your lover. No? We're not feeling lover? I am also your girlfriend. <laughs> I love your parents, and they're nice. Just a little... interesting, I suppose. Come on. You have to tell them at some point, don't you? I mean, I'm not trying to put it on you. I'm not forcing you. It's your choice, and at the end of the day, I'm supporting you with whatever decision you make. But just know that if you decide you want to tell them, I am here, and I am willing to help. And if anything goes wrong literally I love you with the entirety of my heart you can stay at my place in fact I don't get why you're not staying at my place again I love you with the entirety of my heart 
if you wanted to move in right now, I'd be completely down. <laughs> I know. I know. I know. It's hard. You don't want them to see you differently. I get it. I get it. It was the same thing with my folks. You know that. And, well, I guess I understand if you aren't really hoping for the same thing that happened to me to happen to you. But, at the very least, you know that I'm here. I'm here for you, no matter what. Just like you were there for me. And, you have a backup option. Ready to go. At a moment's notice. Yeah. I love you. I know this is awkward and weird having to sneak around. And for as long as you need, I will continue to do that. But I just want you to know that I love you. Even if I'm not able to show it to you as openly in public. Okay? Alright. And no, I am not annoyed or upset with you or anything like that because you asked me to do this. It's 100% fine. I get it. Hopefully, they are a little bit more understanding. Yeah. I'm sure everything will be fine. Besides, if everything's not fine, well... <sighs> I can pay for your therapy. <laughs> I'm not trying to make light of it, I'm just saying. Therapy is good. Everyone should go to therapy. That's a personal belief of mine. Everyone should have some sort of therapy. Especially if, you know, big moments like these don't go right when they're announced. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Come here. Give me another kiss. I have a sneaking suspicion this, these are going to be the last few kisses I get for a while, aren't they? Yeah, that... That felt like the kind of a apology kiss that comes when you know that you're not going to be kissing me in public anytime soon. Oh, I'm so hurt. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I'm okay. I'm less wounded now. <laughs> Uh, do you want to go get coffee tomorrow? Yeah, friends go out to get coffee all the time. Do you want to go get coffee with me? Pretend like we don't know exactly what each other's morning orders are? I mean, we've both done morning runs enough times to know exactly what the other person wants in the morning, so... Mm. Honestly... Honestly, I'm surprised no one's figured it out beforehand. I mean, come on. We spend all of our time together. I'm, I'm just saying, anyways. Coffee. You, me, tomorrow. Yeah? Good. I will make sure to be my best actress self. I don't know if that's actually how you would say that, but I'm going to say it like that anyways. Actress self, and I will, with a solemn heart, play the part of only the best friend tomorrow when we see each other, okay? I love you. <laughs> mm. Good night.